Police are said to have used physical violence against a crowd of demonstrators to protest against a planned migrant center in Germany. A large demonstration in the German town of Greifswald was met with physical violence by local police, after a number of members of the crowd reportedly tried to confront the town's Green Party mayor. With around 500 people in attendance, the demo appears to be one of the latest in a trend of a growing protest movement within Western Europe, with Germany, Ireland and the United Kingdom all seeing multiple demonstrations against the open borders policies of leftist administrations in recent weeks. According to a report by Bild, hundreds of protesters arrived outside a school where a meeting was due to take place between Stefan Fassbinder, Greifswald's Lord Mayor and local representatives on the topic of moving 500 migrants into state accommodation in the area, which was ultimately narrowly approved. BUILD reports local police forces as saying that they met such an attempt with physical violence against demonstrators as some within the group attempted to confront Fassbinder as he left the meeting, with at least one person taking part in the protest being hit with a baton by law enforcement. Police have now opened a number of criminal investigations into the protest, including into the protest's organization, which reportedly is in breach of the law as it was not officially registered with authorities beforehand. A small counter-demonstration which was registered with state officials is also said to have taken place at the school, though was reportedly outnumbered by more than 10 to 1 by those attending the anti-immigration demo. The protest in Greifswald is one of the latest in a long line of demonstrations against migrant centers taking place in Western Europe with many local populations appearing to have run out of patience for their respective countries' open borders policies. Mecklenburg-Western Pomerania, the state where Greifswald is located, appears to be somewhat of a hotbed for this kind of protest in Germany, with another major demonstration taking place in the small town of Uppel against the housing of refugees. According to a report by Deutsche Well, State officials are planning to house 400 migrants in the town of only 1,600 people, prompting a protest of around 700 people earlier this month. A large string of demonstrations against mass migration is also taking place in Ireland, with local communities across the island now taking place in regular demonstrations over the government's plans to bring in tens of thousands of migrants this year. With the country of only 5 million people already facing a crippling housing shortage, the mostly working-class protests have targeted the state's unwillingness to look after Ireland's native homeless, with many also accusing pro-open borders officials of putting women and children in danger by bringing tens of thousands of unvetted, male migrants into various areas. A more isolated protest movement is also slowly starting to grip Britain, with one prominent demonstration at No Slay in Merseyside amid allegations that a local centre was housing nonces, a British term for pedophiles. The demonstration eventually devolved into a riot after pro-open borders Antifa activists tried to disrupt the demonstration.